Josh's mum, Carmel, keeps a tight rein on the finances. I've got, I've got to put 15 towards that to get renew all the games and that. I've got just um, DVD. Ticking me head. Um, got DVDs of me Martins, and I've got a, all my games. All Martins games on. I could get that one out, but then I have to renew them. So by the time I renew all that, it's not. It's it's maddening. The games console has been pawned over 20 times. It costs. I was paying off about a thousand pounds to get pla for a PlayStation. Because we kept on. That's how I run out of money from my habit. I kept on pawning it. I'm taking to cash buttons and pawning it and bring it out every three, well, about every four weeks and putting it back in. And it went fair on him. Sometimes you walk in his gun and he goes, oh, not again. And go off and mad one, would not you? And it's not fair, is it, Josh? Josh? Daddy Norsi, ain't he? Yeah. Vernon's stash is mounted up. Now it's time to sell. It's got to be done. Get a car boot done, because I've got no money. I've sold a few things. If I do that car boot Sunday, it'll be all right. I bought them yesterday for the pound each, like, them two remotes there. And I'm hoping I was going to get, well, I know they're 20 quid usually, like, 12 quid. I thought I'd do, mate. I'm really broke. Oh, the electric's going to go soon. Yeah. All these golf clubs, whatever. All. I mean, if I could sell that for 30, 20 quid, 30 quid, I'd be happy. But as I say, the second hand one of those in cash converters is selling for £129. I was really lucky to get these um, golf clubs for a fourth of each. There's quite a few things uh, in the collectibles I can sell. You know, it's always there as a, a backup. If you are broke, you, if, you, if you've got nothing to sell, then you've had it, and you're not uh, tough. But, OK, yeah, I've, I've got to do the car and get rid of some of the stuff what I've got. How much money do you think you've spent on your habit over the years? Probably. I'll put it, I think we would have bought a house by now. That's true. A couple of cars. Oh, and that's a couple of cars. No, I reckon we would have bought a look nice. Nice for Three bedroom dose. No. Some, I do. Why didn't you throw them out when you discovered them? Um, I just wanted to see if I could get him off it. It's a challenge. Mm, it's a challenge. Love, I'd always say love's blind. Through, well, yeah. Love is blind, isn't it, really? Mm. Time's being called early on Bob. OK. All right. If that's the way it's going to be, that's the way it's going to be. Could have been worse, I suppose. He's been paid £20. Oh, okay. pounds. Thanks. That was a half hour slow. That last set was terrible. I apologise for that, innit? It wasn't terrible. No one left. No, well, it didn't leave, but that's... They're a hard lot to please, guys. Yeah, well... They don't know what their hands are for. <laughs> so it goes. It's a tough old life. Aye. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having us. Well done. Well done. Come on, darling. That's it. An old five-and-dimer is all I intend. Oh, good morning. It's the day of Vernon's car boot sale. Oh, most of it's together. I've got, I've got a few more things to pack. We've got to have some breakfast on that as well. Is that some cold flies? There's a, a thing for this batter, a cash for it somewhere just there. What time is it now? Half oh, five. We've got to be there for about ten to six if we can. Come on, son, get some of this pack. What are you doing? I'm tired. We haven't got time, come on. I'm tired. Come on. Well, I was going to say, Mark, yeah. uh, I was going to get on the bus with all this, yeah? But uh, well, there's too much, there's too much stuff here. I, I don't know if there's any chance you could give us a lift. Look, it's not far, it's, it's about two more, that's all. Three more. 
Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, excellent. Oh, excellent. Oh, that's going to save a lot of trouble then, too. Well, it'll be a bit like, you know. I think those two are going to have to go back in, aren't they? Uh, no room for them. It's a pretty, but they'll go another time. Yeah. Actually, this one will fit on the lap. I've got these two on the front lap. That's a good lap. Yeah. Opening time at install, and Murray's already busy. The customer wants to sell this snooker table outright. How much are you looking to sell it for? As much you can get for it. How old are you? 18. You're, you're 18. And you've got all the everything with it, yeah? Yep. Okay. I've got it for Christmas as well. I've done it once. It's Christmas. Mary. Mary's policy is to offer half of what she thinks she can sell it for. You're looking at about 30. 30? Yeah. Is that with the balls and the keys right. and everything? If I go up to 35 for you, you will sell it for about 70. Is that okay? I'll sell the word my dad's not my dad's. Can I ask your dad? Yeah. yeah, tell him I'll go up to 35. It's a nice one actually, really nice. Very good condition. It's the best one we've had in, condition wise. It's really good, really nice. So let's hope, hope he accepts 30. 35. <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, lovely. Today is a special day for Josh. It's his fifth birthday. <laughs> Martin's got his benefit money. Normally, he'd give it all to Carmel. But today, he's determined to spend some of it on Josh. <laughs> I'm trusting the money, I spend it. <laughs> I'll have the rest of it then. Okay, mate, so, hello, mate. So, uh, hello. Yeah, 40 people profit, better than I think. But well, I should have got two or three quid for it, really, but I want to try and get rid of a couple of things, don't I, first? When I can start picking and choosing when I've got some money in my pocket. Come on, folks. Come and get your bargains. You won't get nothing. You won't get £50, pound, £100, pound, you don't know. You really don't know until you start selling. A quid. Make a good b for the burglars. You're the dad? Yeah. 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 Um, we'll push it up to 35. 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, you get that easy. You'll easily get 150 for it. We wouldn't. I wouldn't be able to put it up. To that. I might. Sorry. I would try. It's only on one ball. Go on. I'll push it up to 50 for you. That's nice. I'm gonna try and get 100 for you. Are you happy with that? I'm happy in that. Yeah. You'll get the 100 easy. Well, I guarantee I hope that. So, yeah. I'm sure you will. Is that the 100 ball? 20, 40, 50. Okay. Thank you. Bye. I don't think we're gonna get 100 pounds for it. So. Um, I'm just trying to prove Mary wrong, really. I'm optimistic, Adam. I will get under pound. <laughs> okay. I'm a sucker. So what? The doobest ones are a tenner. The very doobest ones. And the cheapest ones are...